mpaka wale wakati nyumba ziliisha hawakupewa nafasi ya kurudi sasa wanakaa kama machokora huko nyumba wameshindwa na maji leo hiyo vimejaa leo nimeraoka kwenda kuchota choo na doo mpaka nimechoka hivi sasa nimevaa kinyasa sababu ya kuchoka tutafanya nini wakijenga ngorofa hizi si watatufukuza wataweza kama choo na maji hawatuletei ngorofa wataweza kwanza kuna kitu kimoja hawajatuambia ukweli hapa Hadija hata kisima hakiwezi chimbika hiyo maji wataleta kutoka wapi moja pili yule mtu anasimamia huu mradi mwenyewe ni failure ameshindwa na kamradi kadogo kamilele beach pale mradi wa 500 umemshinda anakuja kusimamia mradi wa 200 billion atawezaje kusimamia hiyo kwa hivyo kwanza watu wambie ni nini kilichofanya ile mradi project ya milele beach kuanguka kabla kutuletea magorofa ya 18 ndani ya Hadija hii Hadija imejamasiwa jichini Hizi nyumba zote unaona wakazi wamejaribu kuchimba vyoo haziwezekani kwa sababu kila mahali ni sewage. Sasa huu mradi wa manyumba ya gorofa 18 itafanywaje ikiwa maji yenyewe sasa hayafiki gorofa moja? I think my position represents the position of the majority of people who are going to be affected. Every single house belonging to the municipal council of Mombasa was sold. Every single house. Now they want to sell the remaining estates of Mombasa through privatization. This is theft by privatization. We are not objecting to the rejuvenation of the city. It is a good idea, it is a good development strategy, it is something I wanted to do as well. But it must be done the right way. There has to be proper consultation, and consultation is not bringing people into a meeting and calling it public participation. The public have to be informed, they have to be given absolute clarity as to how this thing is going to be done.